Life is short, and perhaps too short to watch 60-episode Chinese dramas. Here are 20 best short Chinese dramas for you to binge watch in a day. Order of the Sommelier is a collection of interconnected fairy tales and ghost stories set in modern and ancient rural settings. Fu Yu, a demon hunter, and Bai Qi, a dragon, meet at Bai Qi's demon tavern and get involved in these tales, leading to the evolution of their relationship. Despite simple plots and modest production values, the actors breathe life into the characters, making it an enjoyable watch. Definitely Not Today is a dark comedy with a surprisingly local twist on a Western classic. Mi Chong, an introverted young man planning his exit, is interrupted by the rebellious Xi Liao, leading to a whirlwind of misadventures. Despite some overacting and uneven performances, the drama delivers an enjoyable watch with a positive message about life. Night of Love With You refreshingly explores the concept of characters entering a comic world, with Chi Chi, an antagonist, unexpectedly becoming the female lead. The drama offers enjoyable moments and a unique storyline, complemented by decent quality and acting. While the love square element adds intrigue, the short length leaves some questions unanswered. Nonetheless, the focus on character relationships makes it a worthwhile watch. Destined to Meet You follows Jean Rong Rong and Gu Song Bei, who marry after a drunken encounter and hidden motives. The drama offers an enjoyable and cute romance, with strong chemistry between the leads. The interaction between the main couple is cute, though the female lead's lack of love experience despite being older is puzzling. Overall, it's a quick and easy watch, perfect for passing the time. Maid's revenge plunges into melodramatic depths as Dong Tingyao seeks vengeance for her family's massacre, suspecting warlord Fang Tiani. Tingyao becomes a maid in Tiani's household, encountering one perilous situation after another. Despite its outdated bodice ripper cliches, the sizzling chemistry between the leads and Tiani's commanding presence draw viewers in. A Familiar Stranger is a thrilling drama where Shi Qi is caught in a web of deception orchestrated by Shen Qin. Their faces are swapped by dark magic, leading Shi Qi into marriage with General Xiao Hancheng, while Shen Qin assumes her identity. With witty dialogue and heartfelt performances, this drama is a captivating watch for its addictive mix of suspense and romance. Bossy Husband Who Loved Me follows writer Mu Xiaoxi, who accidentally slips into her novel and completes ten tasks before returning. Unexpectedly, the male protagonist Qin Chuan gains the ability to hear Mu Xiaoxi's wishes, leading to earth-shaking changes in the story's direction. The mini-drama is funny with a strong plot and well-paced storytelling. Provoke initially captivates with its revenge plot, drawing in Du Xuanyu and his father Du Jingchuan with beguiling charm. The main actors deliver masterful performances, with palpable chemistry between the leads. Li Mukun's portrayal of Jiang Ying is particularly captivating, embodying a seductive and manipulative persona. Despite its flaws, Provoke still offers decent entertainment for passing time. In Circle of Love Gu Meng seeks revenge on her former fiancé, warlord Xiao Hongye, but finds herself captivated by him instead. Despite the abusive dynamic, Gu Meng matches Hongye's intensity, leading to a twisted and thrilling saga. The actor's intense chemistry and Li Jolin's portrayal of the controlling Hongye are captivating. While the plot has its twists, the main draw is the dark romance. In Emperor or Boss, Fu Bao's wish to sleep with her boss comes true on her 24th birthday, but complications arise when the owner of the wish notes, claiming to be a king, shows up. Caught between her boss and the emperor, Fu Bao's troubles begin in this lighthearted and cute romance, perfect for stress relief and binge-watching. The drama avoids common romance tropes like angst and misunderstandings, featuring a love triangle that adds humor without being annoying. Love Strikes Back follows Lin Yen, who pretends amnesia to seek revenge on her betraying fiancé and friend. Teaming up with her loyal bodyguard Xiao Mo, they plot to reclaim her stolen company, leading to unexpected emotional entanglements and thawing Lin Yan's heart. The series captivates with the sizzling chemistry between the leads, delivering energy and emotion in perfect harmony. With twists, joy, and laughter in each episode, it's a gem, enhanced by the humor of the supporting cast and the captivating presence of Guo Jinan. Dong Lan Shui follows Shen Yan and 7th Prince Chuning Yuan, both seeking revenge and power due to tragic pasts. Despite their cold exteriors, they find warmth in each other. Chuning Yuan falls for Shen Yan, who remains indifferent, even orchestrating his marriage to disrupt his plans. Despite its brief episodes, it builds chemistry and showcases Qi Xia Xia's stellar performance and stylish portrayal. Ideal for quick drama fixes, especially for those short on time. Deliberations of Love follows modern woman Lu Qing, transported to the ancient world, replacing Su Qing and facing unwanted engagements. Across multiple transmigrations, she strives to alter her fate. The plot unfolds seamlessly, allowing for deep character development and subversions of expectations. Leads and their adorable chemistry and strong supporting roles enhance the narrative. 
Impressive production values, including sets, costumes, and music, elevate the drama. My Decoy Bride follows Princely Xu Bai, who fakes amnesia to evade a murderous bride, Jiang Yu Xiao, only to discover her mysterious identity. The story unfolds with the couple competing in secret while being drawn to each other. Despite its short episodes, the drama rivals full-length productions with its quality and coherence. It boasts a strong female lead and avoids stereotypes, with well-choreographed martial arts sequences and believable romantic chemistry. What's Wrong With My Princess blends revenge with romance, as General Maron Chiu Yu seeks retribution after being betrayed and killed by her loved ones. Reborn, she allies with the seventh prince, Li Jian, to take down her enemies, including her sister and the second prince. The series effectively depicts the protagonist's growth of trust and closeness, with each revenge plot serving as satisfying payback. The acting, particularly by the seventh princess, is commendable. While the ending is predictable, it doesn't overshadow the engaging narrative. Killer is also romantic tells the tale of Si Xiaonian and Yan Wu Ming, who marry but soon reveal their hidden identities. Despite its brevity, the drama creatively utilizes its resources, delivering a concise yet engaging story. It effectively captures the essence of the wuxia genre with well-executed romance, action, and comedy elements. While the ending lacks impact and subtitles could be improved, it's a satisfying option for a quick wuxia fix with solid performances and logical plot progression. The Only Girl You Haven't Seen is a thrilling short drama featuring palace conspiracies and hidden identities. After being framed and murdered, a cheese soul inhabits the body of Ling Li, the daughter of General Ling Xiao. She unwittingly marries Hilian Qian, the fifth prince, whom she gradually falls in love with. The drama is marked by superb acting, excellent chemistry between the leads, and skillful incorporation of martial arts and intrigue. The drama also has a second season. An Ancient Love Song is a mesmerizing tale where Shen Bian, a professor, is transported back in time and meets the formidable Lu Yuan. The story unfolds in reverse chronological order, offering a unique viewing experience. Their love transcends time, creating a captivating saga. Despite its low budget, the production shines, anchored by Zhang Yakin's stunning performance. Queen of Attack follows Liang Weiwei, a girl with superhuman strength, who is transported into a historical drama starring her idol, Jing Qing. Determined to change her tragic fate as the disgraced empress, Weiwei uses her knowledge of idol dramas to alter the storyline. The bubbly and resilient female lead and the evolving male lead shine. The harem plots and political intrigue add excitement, but Wei Wei's determination to survive stands out. With captivating love scenes, well done costumes, and music, it's a fantastic show worth recommending and rewatching. Which mini drama have you watched? Let me know in the comments.